Yeah, meeting them all later. Felix, how'd you do it, man? Oh, shit. It's fucking true. Oh, word spreads fast. Tony, Jesus, it's good to see you. How's business, Felix? Just there working all the angles? It's tough, Tony. I've been laying low, you know, since you left. Sosa's trying to run me out. He's putting the squeeze on all the small-time suppliers. Surprise! All that gonna change. The others are pissed. Nacho Contreras and the Diaz brothers lost out. They heard about Sosa working with Gaspar. It's a war, Tony. They're all trying to take over what you had. Tell me what you know, man. I was at your storehouse two months ago, you know? I didn't know what was going on. Word on the street was that you were dead, so I had to look around. When I got there, I recognized a couple of your guys, but then I saw Gaspar. He was inside watching over the loading of a delivery truck. I bought a couple of keys off them, but the price was jacked. It's been tough since you left, Tony. There are only a few independent dealers you can trust anymore. That's all gonna change. Do you work for me? We take this town by the balls. I'm with you, Tony, if you need me, man. I need to start making my own moves. Gotta get back in, you know? Gonna have to pay off the vice to get my mansion back, fuckers. From there, we can rebuild the business. Take what I've got to get you started. Talk to Coco. She's one of the only dealers we can trust anymore. She works the bar down in the Grove. If you ever need a hit to get rolling, just come find me, Tony. Okay, man. It's good to have you back, man. Fucking cockroach! Get out of the car, man! Fuck that shit! Miami police! It's uh, it's like undercover, man. I'm taking your car. Hey, fucker! Pick it up at the lot. You're a fucking bigger asshole than you are. Give me a scotch. On the rocks? Straight up. I know you. No, we never met. No, but you've been here before. A long time ago, you were with another man. Tall, good-looking Cuban guy. Oh, you got a good memory, Tiger. Felix forgot to mention that. Felix? <laughs> that dog? He owes me a night out. You know each other? Felix is working for me now. He said you might be interested in what I got to offer. Well, that's fine in the boy, isn't it? Look, supply is tight in Miami right now. Expensive. All my shit's being controlled by Gaspar Gomez. That prick keeps the prices too high. I know this town better than anyone. I get the shit, you sell it. I collect my coin, you keep yours. Hmm. Okay. You've got a deal. What do you go by? Montana. But you can call me Tony, okay, Posica? Okay, Tony. I can only push so much product in a day. The bar has its limits. The others around, though, just can't always trust them. Me? I only trust one person. I hear you, Tiger. Okay, let's make this happen. Hey, what you got for me, man? You walk away like you did me some favor.
We got to cut the shit. I kept to you for this. Oh, come on, man. It's good. You don't want me to call the senator on you, do you? You're a depressing sight. I love my big Bobby. He makes me feel so safe. Hey, where Fuck you get this shit, man? man? I got I'll a great shit, deal for you, but man. But only if it's grade A, okay? You're doing a good job, man. Keep it up. Why are you bleeding me, man, huh? Fine. You know what? Take the money. The government not paying you clowns enough? Hey, buddy, we're Vice. Not some loose-knit government agency looking for handouts. You know how this is gonna work from here on out, don't you? Fuck you. Mayor Bernstein tried this shit on me once, and it didn't work out so good for him, you know. Mayor? He wasn't a team player, Montana. You did us all a favor. Look, Montana, Miami is our backyard. The people pay us to make sure scumbags like you keep the economy nice and stable. We don't want to get in the way unless you force us to, understand? Our boys in the street keep tabs on you. You start doing too many things that upset the people, then your heat goes up. If your heat gets too high, then we'll be forced to make a house call. So, if you want to keep it cool with us, Montana, we suggest you make a donation. Maybe you two should go home and donate a little something to your wives, you know? Relax a little. <laughs> We're watching you, boy.